idea to make the cutest gift basket for the squishmallow lover in your life so for halloween we had boo baskets but since it's christmas since it's the december holidays we're going to be making burr baskets squishmallow burr baskets i have three of my holiday themed squishmallows behind me i have nikki the angel guri the gnome and then jack skellington from nightmare before christmas I don't have any other Christmas Squishmallows, so he is gonna do for now. I know, it's like a debate. Is Nightmare Before Christmas a Christmas movie or is it a Halloween movie? I think it's a, I think it's a Christmas movie. Um, I don't know why I said Christmas. I think Nightmare Before Christmas is a Halloween movie. Halloween. And the idea for this, it could be for any budget. You could go shopping at the dollar section in Target, the 99 cent store, Bath and Body Works, literally anywhere so that you could get any of these items for your basket. This will be our shopping basket. So as you can see, I laid out all the options that we could put in our baskets. Of course, if you're shopping for someone, you don't exactly want to re-gift something. If you're going to re-gift something, make sure you don't use it first. Like, all these are used. I'm not going to give this actually to a person. This is just an idea for you guys so that you can give it to a friend, a family member, a crush, who knows. Let me show you what we're working with. So this first section are the candles. A bunch of these are from Bath and Body Works. We have the Cozy Cashmere, a candied maple bacon. If you know anyone who likes that combination, go to Bath and Body Works and get this candle. This one I got from a small business. It's a Taylor Swift Midnight's album themed lavender haze scented. This one smells so good, but I haven't actually like burned it yet because i just i don't want to ruin it and then this one is the most christmassy it is a spiced apple toddy next is a skincare i got these lashes recently at tj maxx we have some lip glosses or lip balms a lotion this one's candy cane scented and then face mask down here i also have my squishmallow stickers my sister got these for me from timu and then i make a bunch of squishmallow reusable sticker book shorts on instagram and youtube oh no wait tiktok and youtube now we have the tumblers and the mugs people love to get something to drink out of we have a hogwarts tumbler my taylor swift eras tour cup that i got at the movie theater this cute donut cup and then a christmas mug now are some books for the book lover in your life i freaking love reading books recently and i love these books so we have icebreaker i love that book but pretty spicy you guys pretty spicy so if you are not old enough to read spicy don't read that and of course dash and lily i've been watching this every year during christmas time i think it's one of the best holiday specials to watch on netflix this section more things to add in your squish basket this is a diy headband that i made we have a pouch that i got from walgreens the collectible tin from toy drops a clip and this, I did not make this, but I bought this off of someone who made Squishmallow mini earrings. So for the DIY Squishmallow earrings, it looks like the person just sewed a thread through the Squishmallow and then bought these hooks off of Amazon, or you could get them at Michael's or Joann's. Let me see. I think it is a little bit heavy to wear on the ear, but as a photo op, I think it'd be something cute to wear. Oh, you know what? It's actually not heavy at all. There it is. That's what it looks like on. And... I did make a short about this, but all I did was buy a black headband. Mine was from the dollar store. It did have cloth on it, so I just chopped off the cloth and I bought a nice Gorilla Glue. I held it on about a minute. It was perfect. Final section is accessories. We have jewelry and scarves. You could even put blankets and socks in this too. Going off of Nikki's white and blue color, I think I want to choose the book for this one. So I'm going to go for the books. And for the candle, we don't have any blue candles, but I'm thinking probably the midnight one. And, oh, this for sure. I'm kind of thinking, should I put the Taylor cup here just because I have the Taylor candle? All right. And the jewelry. So I'm going to do this for now. We'll see if it's going to fit even in the basket. So I plan to put Angel in this basket here. It, she is kind of large, so I don't know if all this stuff is going to fit. But I want her to stick out a bit more, maybe to make her a bit taller. 
So you could use tissue paper or something nicer than this But right now all I have are some plastic bags I just folded them in fours and I'm gonna see if this will elevate it I think that's okay Okay, because I want the books to be seen I'm going to put an empty jar at the bottom of this. Oh, now I have an idea. So instead of an empty jar, you could actually fill this up with candy, like candy canes or chocolates, and that would be a cute addition to this. And display the books right on top. Christmassy, I think it'd be a good idea to add these red bows to it. You could get this from Michael's. This is where we got ours. Now, as an added part to the basket, I got these twinkle lights from Amazon and they have nine settings. This is my favorite. So when you give this as a gift, you'll just hide the battery pack in the back of the basket and you drape this around. so much more to it. This looks so cute. On to our next shopping. We're going to be doing Guri the Gnome. This one I think is going to be super red green traditional Christmas colors. We're going to go with the spice apple toddy and let's give mm, let's do all these three, okay? Whoever this is for, they love lip products and lotion. And maybe this mug, I think it'll be really fitting. I kind of want to put the penguin, I have an idea, like clipping it on the basket handle. And this. I got this from TJ Maxx. It's like a bunch of bracelets. It says Mary Joy, has a Santa Claus charm. I think it's super cute. And I also want to put the scarf there too. So I've been seeing a lot of those holiday gift guide videos recently on YouTube, you know, they come around every year and for me, I'm not quite sure exactly what I'd want for Christmas every year nowadays, I'm not really sure I think I asked for Barnes & Noble gift cards so I could choose any book that I want and also a Bobby Goods coloring book because I see that a lot on TikTok, it's so therapeutic, oh my god This one, I think I'm going to clip it right here Oh, the basket is a little thick. Here we go. Okay, I think I want to add the bow to this too. Although I like this side of the mug more because Minnie has a cute outfit on, I'm just going to face it this way so it doesn't cover up the gnome too much. I went to Five Below the other day because I thought that they'd already have the Squishmallows out for Christmas and they had zero. They did have some Christmas decorations already out but then no Squishmallow in sight. Apparently they've dropped like a Hello Kitty Squishmallow squad and then some of the previous Squishmallow minis. Let's add some stickers into this mug. Penguin, bee, lamb, Dalmatian, leopard, fox, dinosaur, or rhinoceros. This is truly a great basket. I think it's because of the way that the basket actually looks. This is probably from Michael's as well, but you could get your baskets anywhere. I love that! I'm obsessed with this one. If I was actually giving this to someone, I would be so proud of myself. All right, Jack Skellington, now we are down to the third and last basket this person who gets this basket they would love candy maple bacon and they are a fan of harry potter let's give them face mask this one they'll get the ultimate squishmallow basket squishmallow pouch a headband and also the collectibles i'm probably going to use this basket instead of this one because this is so tall it's just gonna be falling in there. When I was thinking of the idea for this video, I really wanted to do blue and white theme for Angel, green and red for Guri, and then a black theme for Jack Skellington. But I realized I don't have a lot of like, like black candle, black cups and stuff. So this just gets the mismatch of things.
All right, there's the last basket. We have all the Squishmallow toys, the cups, skincare, and of course, the bow. I took the twinkling lights and then I wrapped it around this handle. So if you do get a basket that has a handle, I think this is a nice idea to decorate the basket with. Oh, that was tiring. We did all these three baskets. Which one is your favorite out of the three? Which one would be the one that you would be most excited to get as a gift? I feel like I said that is so weird. Okay, that's it.